guys, welcome back to another Roblox tutorial. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make a double jump game pass. So let's get started by inserting a script into server script service. And then we can just do local ID and then we can just leave this blank for now. And then we can do game.players.playeradage colon connect and then a function and plr. And then we can do plr.character at added colon connect and then a function and then chr and then we can do if game colon get service marketplace service user owns game pass a sync game dot players and chr dot name dot user id comma id then local db jump equals script dot local script colon clone and then db jump dot parent equals plr dot backpack and then in here we are going to insert a local script and then we can do local uis equals game get get service and then user input service local player equals game dot players dot local player local character and local humanoid and then we can do local can double jump is equal to false and then we can do local has double jump is equal to false local old power local time underscore delay equals 0 0.1 Local jump underscore multiplier equals to 1.2. Then we can do function on jump request if not character or not humanoid or not character is descendant of workspace or humanoid calling get state equals equals enum dot humanoid state type dot dead then return and we can actually just make that a lowercase workspace and then after this end we can go down and we can do if can double jump and not has double jumped then has double jump equals to true humanoid dot jump power with a capital p equals old power times the jump multiplier and then just to cover what the jump multiply multiplier does is one would be it's not your normal jump power and then um so if you change it to do two then it would be double the normal jump power for the second jump and then we can do humanoid colon change state and then enum dot humanoid state type dot jumping and then we can go down and we can do local function character added new and then we can do character equals new humanoid equals new wait for child humanoid has double jumped is equal to false and can double jump is equal to false and then old power is equal to humanoid dot jump power and then we can go down again and we can do humanoid dot state changed colon connect and then a function and then we can do old comma new and then we can also do if new equals equals enum dot humanoid state type dot landed then can double jump is equal to false and has double jump is equal to false and humanoid dot jump power is equal to old power and then we can do else if new equals equals enum dot humanoid state type free fall then wait time delay and then we can do can double jump is equal to true and then we're almost done but we just have to do if player dot character 
then character added player dot character and then we can go down and we can do player dot character added colon connect character added and then we can do uis dot jump request colon connect on jump request like that all right and then that should wrap up the script and there's one last thing we have to do you have to make sure you publish your game so you can go to game settings and then publish it I'm just going to name this two times jump and create it. And then you can go to roblox.com and hit create. Then go to the place and then go to store and add a pass. And then you can look for a file, name it, preview it, verify upload. Go ahead to configure. Make sure that if you want to sell it, then you can item for sale and hit save. And then you're just going to want to copy this ID right up there. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go into the normal script and paste it there. Make sure that there are no parentheses around it. I just put parentheses there just to be a placeholder. Oh, and we do have an error. It is because I cannot spell humanoid. There we go. Now I actually just get rid of these parentheses that Roblox automatically puts there. Also make sure that you have change date spelled correctly and then we can play test it and there we go we can jump twice if you did find this video helpful and it did help you and you enjoyed it please don't forget to like this video and even subscribe if you are not already the model will be linked in the description below so that you guys can go download it if you do end up downloading it i just ask that in return that you would subscribe to my channel thank you for watching and i'll see you next time